sorry. I haven't seen you since the fly. And so much has happened since. The whole world gone mad. Bulk 2017 was a great success. We started on Sunday and ended the following Sunday and we had events on morning and events on in the afternoon, early evening concerts and late night concerts. We did have a festival of diversity. People like that because you do take a risk when you do diversify. Some people might argue that the music that is being played by a lot of the young groups is not Irish because of all the different influences that have been coming in. But different influences have been coming in for years. Irish traditional music is in, a, in an extremely healthy state at the moment. But compared to the, first, the last time I played in Derry, which was in 1976, there were very, very few musicians in the town at that stage. But now you see there are absolutely so many musicians, and it's not only in Derry, but it's all over the country. Play with no ornamentation. Play with those with whom you can be heard. Play out of respect. We play it in festivals and fashion it now. I grew up in a very musical family. We just learned a great love of music through the social aspect of it, playing for Kayleys and, and meeting friends and going to the flas and all that. So for me, music has always been something to enjoy. Festival, we had musicians from the Isle of Man, from Wales and Scotland and in America and you have to make those connections. Where the music is gone it's, it's kind of connected in a different way and it's taken it in its own direction but it's still deeply rooted in the Celtic music. There's always something new to learn, there's always a new musician to meet, there's always somebody with a new angle on the music and that's what really makes it exciting. Derry is the perfect location for a festival. It's a compact city, it's easy to navigate, it's easy to walk around. And that's what people do in, in festivals as well, outside of coming to events. It gives them a chance to walk around and take in the city and all the city has to offer. I 
absolutely delighted to be up here in Derry tonight because we played once before in the Guild Hall. It was when the Oireachtas was in Derry. I mean, when you walk into this historical building and you look at the craftsmanship, it's really a pleasure to be up here. On Raglan Road of an autumn day I saw her first and knew that her dark hair would weave a snare that I might one day rue. We're going to start planning now for next year's festival. We're wrapping up all, tying up all the lessons for the 2017 one. So that's that's where we're at now, 2018. <laughs>